We back. <gasps> K-pop. On lock two and off. Back for another one. And what am I looking at here, Koo? It is the 2015 Mama Music Awards Music Awards performance, which is what right. we caught that. Uh, That's the, right. The We're BTS back. in 2018, yep. which we thought was super good in a cool format. People gave <laughs> a lot of information on what that is, that it is, in fact, a music ceremony, award ceremony, yeah, but they just have the in-betweens. They're huge award shows yeah there's it this is the mnet asian music awards M-Net 2015 asian music awards okay so that explains the second ma because i knew it was going to be music awards but and that also answers the question of there's just no comparable award ceremony i don't think in no these are in the u.s these no not even close. These are massive. I think um, this one, you had you had almost 30 groups perform at this one, I believe. How like, long does this ceremony go for? Yeah. Because that's, um, that's you like had, a full concert festival. You had day. groups like BTS, uh, Big Bang, XO, I think, 17 when they were rookies. This uh, so if this is this is gonna be good, you're gonna like this. I've seen a little bit of it. I didn't want to spoil it. All right. Um, but I read a lot about it. So if we had like a K-pop time machine, you this is you definitely want to go back to this one. Okay, and it's CL and Two N E One. That's right. Have we covered either of them? No, so CL, she's a member of 2 Anyone. Oh, so is this her alone and then the full band? Yeah, so I think what happened here is everyone thought it was just going to be her performing um, the song Fire. Oh. And then, to everybody's surprise, the whole group came out. Okay, nice. So they had maybe been uh, separated for a little bit. So is this kind of like a reunion performance? They so to my knowledge, they were on a bit of a hiatus, and that's why it was such a big deal. Nice. But um, yeah. All right. Well, let's check it out. I'm excited to see it. Uh, Let's see what CL is bringing to the table. So is "Hello Bitches" a song, or is that just her introducing herself to the crowd? It's got to be a song. (laughs) <laughs> All right, I yeah, let's check it out. It was an awesome one with BTS, so I'm sure this is gonna be good. CL to anyone, hello bitches and fire. Baddest female. I love that they have a the baddest female award. Is that an award? That's what it said. Or are they just are they just saying baddest female? CL, she's the baddest female. I, I think I it's think an award. We're gonna find out. Yeah, let's check it out. How dare you set them on fire? So I'm, that's awesome. I'm noticing when it was the BTS one, they were in like a central stage platform surrounded. This one is more kind of a traditional award show mm-hmm. setup. So I guess, is that the same location? No, do um, do I don't think so. I think this one's in Hong Kong, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. I don't know where the last one we watched was. Hello, bye plus Chez. That's how they work around it. 
maybe yeah, a little maybe. more control in Hong Kong. Like, we, you can't write that. They use the plus instead of the asterisks we use. But all right, let us, let us know if it, he's saying Hong Kong. I believe it looks like a new venue to me, or rather an older venue because it's three years earlier. Your voice or my boys? I wish you're gonna have to check out the lyrics, lyrics, buddy. Yeah, the dancers are very colorful. They have their own. She's got some. uh, She's got kind of a Michael Jackson. She's got some serious energy. Yeah, she does. Um, I love. (laughs) She came out with the the Mohawk uh, Roman soldier. So you, I don't know if you remember, you asked about this group because when we were watching the last Baby Monsters last evaluation, right. And uh, they came on screen, and you were like, "Who, who is that?" They had kind of the Road Warrior oh, punk yes. gear on, right? I did. Okay, so that's so. This group is like one of YG's uh, first big groups. Are they Generation One or Generation Two? I think they're two. I'm not exactly sure how the generation thing works, but I think they're second. All right, so they preceded the. Uh, the Baby Monster and Blackpink. Yeah. Generation previous. Yeah. But, yeah, I remember. They had a lot of attitude and were dressed almost like 1980s wrestlers, I think. Right, yeah, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> so nice. I like it. These girls got attitude. I like the dancers, And too. we haven't even gotten this to... This one looks like she's having a ball. <laughs> so this one looks like she's about to crack up, That's like funny. someone did something funny. This one just looks like a zombie. If you had to pick out which one is the zombie... It's this one. She's got the look. She's coming for a bite. Okay. That's all I'm saying. All right. Let's let's keep on with back the Back it shit. up a little, just a tiny bit. Back it up more? I already backed it up. Oh, you did? Okay. Yeah. I wasn't going to miss anything. <laughs> Lights out, killing it some more. Bad girls get down on the floor. 
All right, there it is. Whoa. You didn't get to see you didn't get to see quite as much of uh the crowd in that one. There they're going down. Do you get the feeling that this girl is like her bestie when they're on the road and she's no, doing so I didn't get I didn't get that feeling. I got the feeling of this CO is fierce. She is. But this girl is prominent and they're smiling at each other. When they're running down the runway, they're uh like right here, they like look at each other. But yeah, she is. Ooh, that looks like it's gonna be cool. So they split up the performances, and there's probably that's the baddest girl, and hello bitches. Then there's little break. They give an award, and then they're gonna the next one. I don't think so, buddy. I know she's just gonna pop back out of the floor. Well, you've seen some of it. Okay. Uh, I haven't gotten this far into it, so. I don't see as many of the light sticks. I think people were saying BTS people brought so many light sticks that they had to ban light sticks from future award shows. They did, but that was three years after this. Right. What does the 21 light stick look like? So it's the four of them. Yeah. The crowd is going insane because they thought she was going to pop out. And then they did the old switcheroo. And they're like, wah! Get back! Yeah. It's, it's very cool. Nice surprise. And because I'm a moron, live from Hong Kong. <laughs> Clearly <laughs> stated in the top left. That happens a lot. Uh, nice. So that mystery solved. Uh, let's check it out, though. Fire!
So, I, I thought I saw that it looked like their light stick was like a lotus flower or something like that. Is that what that was? It they was may like, they may not have one, bro, because yeah. it's... Um, well, there was someone with a light stick. For I'm sure. going to mark it. It was 746. But back to the beginning. It was very definitive right when they started out and it showed the crowd. And maybe we can't find it. Yeah, but I did see what you were talking about. Yeah, it was yellow. I neglected to mark the time. There. Oh, oh wait, no, there they are. So you can see a little bit in the crowd. Here they are, the, the yellow. There's a, looks like a bunch of different ones. Yeah, there are. That's Is that the BTS one? And then that might be the Mama Moo. Or I'm, I'm sorry, the... Blackpink hearts, but Blackpink no. weren't around in 2013. No, Blackpink wasn't yeah. a thing yet, bro. Yeah, this this is these girls are. I'm gonna say, but I feel like that's it. There's someone with a purple one, so it's kind of cool that everyone brought everyone brings their own favorite light stick. It's a shame that they got banned in a sense later in years. Yeah, but I mean, I would just be sporting like a belt with full of light sticks, ready for whoever's coming on at the time. Like, I'm ready to get in on the action. Whoever it is, we're going to do this. It's a cool setup with the lights there. But let's get back to it. What was it, 747? 746? 726? 26? No, I don't know. I forgot what you said. Well, if we catch a little bit. I
my god. Is she pretending? Oh. <laughs> I wow. thought she was doing a pretend to smoke a cigarette. <laughs> wow. Let's go! Oh my god. I get drowned out in yellow. I'm gonna say the yellow is for the Man. lotus flower. Man. Although I didn't think lotus flowers were typically yellow. Yeah, I did see what you're talking about, that light stick, but um there was also a uh, like a rainbow, literally just like a stick that was a rainbow colored too that I saw some people having okay. up. That shaved head girl was back. I'm telling you, it's CL's bestie. They're on the road. She's not with the other gals in the bands. Are doing their solo project. Who do you hang out with? Who do what you get you, emotional what are you talking support about? from? Solo. What are you talking about? Well, it was CL by herself, so she must be doing. Oh, the, that's them. That's them right there. The four of them. No, but the beginning of it was just CL. Okay. So she clearly had some I don't, form of solo. I don't, I don't get it. Thing. But then why wouldn't people assume that the other girls were going to be there? Good call. Obviously, I'm just, I'm just not sure where you're going with it. That's all. I'm telling you, it gets lonely on the road. <laughs> and you got to have emotional support. You got to have someone that you can pal around with. And if the other girls aren't going to be there, she obviously has a good fun relationship with this shaved head dancer girl well this was i'm picking uh, it up i can see the this, vibes of this friendship. was amazing yeah it was a good performance they, i like uh, i will say that they, i feel like it was a little rusty on some of the dance moves i don't know i haven't seen any of their videos aside from that tiny clip on the one thing where they looked awesome but it didn't seem like they uh, it seemed kind of thrown together haphazardly to me in terms of wow. the dance aspect of it. Okay. Because they, I feel like it's almost, they were a couple couple specific moves put down, but most of it is kind of freestyle and memory from previous performance together. I feel like they almost didn't know they were going to do it until close to when this was going down. Mm. And, be, and maybe because they were trying to keep it a secret, that there wasn't a lot of time. If they had seen them on stage together practicing, then they'd be like, "Yeah, oh, they were spotted together. Give away the secret." Well, you could That's feel it. the. Oh yeah. You could feel the energy. Definitely. From them and obviously the crowd, but. Definitely, I, I like it. I had only heard of their. Their stage presence prior to this. Right. And it's. They got. It's. And they're all very pretty they're, too. They're awesome. I like them. Striking their pose, the dancers did their work too. But yeah, I would be super psyched. What would be like the equivalent for a band for us if you saw them come back on stage? I can't really think of a lot of bands I'd listen to that split into solos. For Maybe us? If like, if like, yeah, we used to watch reggae. It'd be like if, if they were live and Bob Marley and the Whaler, Bob Marley, Peter Tosh, and Bunny Whaler all suddenly were together on stage together. After a lengthy period of time. Yeah. And you'd just be like, what? Yeah. Yeah, I can't think of anything. Do you know that many big groups? Or, like, I watch a lot of solo acts, I guess I would say. Or, or maybe, like, the Beatles or something like that. I guess that would be kind of an equivalent, like when they did that rooftop performance mm. back in the day that people drove people nuts. They're like, they're back together! And they're like, nope, just this. And you're like, oh. <laughs> yeah, so we, I think, we aren't that old. So we weren't around for that, but. Yeah, so I think for them, they debuted in 2009, I believe. Okay. And this is 2015 here, right? Right. So, and they, they only had like a seven-year run at it. Although they did go back. Um, well, that would mean they would still be together at this point yeah like i said i think they were on a hiatus for a little bit prior to this um but they did go to coachella in 2022 i believe okay so and it was still... another little surprise i think there too nice well there you go coachella's bringing in alternate people although i just saw an article today that was saying how coachella became 
the worst music festival out there. It wasn't talking about the musicians. It was talking about, like, the actual setup. And, like, I remember hearing there were sound issues on week one that people were angry about. But it was complaining sort of about that and about the, the fans going there not being... They would rather take selfies on their phones than they would sing along with a song to their yeah, favorite be- artist. Yeah, that makes sense because it's... It's almost like a fashion thing now because everybody dresses up, right? And they want to take their selfies. All right, piece of shit. We we would have sang along if we were there, even though I don't know the words. I would have been right in, screaming happy, full attention. That or drinking water, a whole lot of water. It's in the desert. But yeah, these girls are good. We gotta go back and check out. Like yeah, that mu- find that music video where they're dressed up like the wrestlers. Yeah, that's um, I am, I am the best. I am. That's awful confident of you. You know what? You <laughs> are the best. Cool. Glad to be here with you. Um, and with uh, what's the two any one? Yeah, it's what? Do we know what their fans are? We, they're not called the Lotus. We do <laughs> no. They are the Blackjacks. The Blackjacks? I like that one. Because, uh, well, I don't know exactly why, but I think when they first debuted, they their name was supposed to be 21, but uh, another singer had it or something like that. So, to any... So, they changed... To anyone. They changed it up. To, to anyone. To anyone. And, yeah, Blackjacks. Nice. I like that. I like that name a lot. I knew you would, uh, I knew you would like it. Because I am a compulsive gambler. So it's what I could do. But it just sounds good. Blackjack. You know, it's like hard hitting. Kind of like the image uh, they put out. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That was that was solid. That was a good uh, intro to them for me. It's awesome and to go back and see see kind of where... I, I know they're second generation, but to go see the kind of where, where it all came from. Absolutely. And I don't get like these groups are so good. My tendency, like if you if I did an equivalent of the kind of music I normally listen to and then transposed it into K pop, I would be listening probably as far the closest to new I would be listening to second generation and probably more likely listening to all first generation. Not that I know what the style back is then, but I just tend to it like takes about old, 20 years of being out before I generally start like the listening old to stuff, it. Yeah. yeah. So I have no problem going into these bands. So let us know. Who's your favorite second gen band? Who's your favorite to any one gal? Uh, what's the best video? What other performances? What do you know about CL and her bestie shaved head <laughs> dance girl? Because I'm telling you, they're friends. They're close. They probably go out for, I don't know, kimchi and Korean barbecue after the show and just laugh and laugh and laugh and have fun on the road. Uh, Yeah, that was solid. Good find, oh, yeah. too. Or was this suggested? Oh, no, this was suggested a while ago. All right. People like these uh, mama performances. But nice. Yeah, thank thank you, epic. Uh, Blackjacks and other fans. Just general fans of the music. It's always nice when people have caps a wider net. Because we all have our favorite bands, but I think a lot of them have a lot of good music putting out. So I like when someone uh, suggests an artist kind of outside of your typical lane. They're like, we know you're getting into this. Stay in this lane. But at the same time, jump over here. Haven't seen them? Also a great band. So we love to see that. And yeah, we'll be back. Check out some other Mama performances. More to anyone. More CL. It'll be great. It'll be great. Can't wait for it. Uh, we'll let you go, though, because I actually have to attend a video conference to see if I can get better at all this techie jibber-jabber. I'm trying to learn to improve the channel for all of you and just give the best gosh darn reactions we can. Okay? So we'll be back. A little bit of cool, a little bit of us. K pop on lock. We'll see you on the next one. Peace. Blackjack, baby.